controller chaos. I'm Evan, this is D-Heart, and we're not quite done yet. But we will be! Stay tuned to see us kick some fucking ass! We're not trying. So, we're, we're, we're here cutting through, we just cut through the, the rest of the 70s. We have a 280 now. It's hyper combat with the suit detail on this one. Everything is in fast motion, both, both players have invented players. This is going to be fun. I know exactly what you're going to do, so go ahead and do it. Oh, okay. Begin. I mean, I wanted to film this one because I know what it's going to mean. It's going to be chaos. And what? It's... <laughs> of course! Why not go for that immediately? And again. Again. <laughs> George, George, <laughs> but George Romero and the Micro Machines guy had a fucked up baby in this game. You know what I mean? And it's over. Just like that. Just like that! And it's cheap, but you know, we're trying to get through these. Yeah, we're flying through this. Let's see, rock your world. Oh shit, I should have read that. Every hit. No, it's tilting world. No, okay. world tilts. So, d what would you say is your favorite thing about the Challenge Tower? Uh, something to do. I'd say by far the best thing about the Challenge Tower is how it forces you to play characters you wouldn't normally play as, and that makes you a better more combat player in general. That's really the most beneficial thing about it. Yeah, we're almost there at the top, and we're rewarded with more freak on freak matches. We got on this match was Shiva versus Goro. My thing is, I think these four on freaks in the game, Goro, Shiva, and Kintaro, they're all missing their true calling. They could be out like they could be the best circus freaks ever, or even better than that. They could be fucking the world's most disgusting and awesome juggling team with tits. Or if uh, if all else fails, they can work at the gap. Close. That's right, I mean, picture, I can see Shiva right now wearing a nice, like, four, <laughs> a nice purple cardigan sweater with four holes cut in it, you know, like a sweater vest. One side's folding this bitch in a uh, cardigan, while his other side, the other two arms, are folding up a pair of really sweet desert brown slides. She's a man for the if you ask me. Yeah, but they can't wear a t-shirt. You have to come up with some other completely new letter. An X shirt, or sideways H with T on the side. Sure. Yeah. I win, motherfuckers. That's right. Well, we unlocked the 300 challenge, the final challenge of the fucking challenge tower, which I argue should still be spelled with K. The challenge tower. <laughs> Our brave warriors have climbed to the top of the Mortal Kombat challenge tower. What ferocious challenge awaits them? Get over here to Mortal Kombat the Restaurant. Drop in and check out our new menu items, like the treacherous tacos of terror, Kano says bueno, or Jack stacks of racks of ribs, or our new Barack kebabs. Take home a bucket of Kentaro fried chicken, why don't ya? Free shotgun queso with every order. You get to keep the collectible helmet bowl. Don't forget our frozen drink specials. Who ordered the Kung Lao main? Mortal Kombat the restaurant. <laughs> Flawless eatery. Are you kidding me? I can choose. You can choose. God, this is uh, this is a moment. But I think it's gotta be something that you're you're really fucking good with. Pretty good with Scorpion. I'm cool. pretty comfortable with him. He's get up and go. It's pretty great. We'll see how this goes. Hopefully you don't have to give one chance. What if we get one chance of this and then we go back to the bar? <laughs> God, I shouldn't say shit like what? that.
At 146 today, I became Mortal Kombat Master. Stage 300 complete. That's right, motherfuckers. We hit level 300. You saw it here first. Tune in very soon at UnitedCypher.net. Check out the crazy adventures of myself and D-Hard here as we play old school games, new school games, and games that no one should play ever again. See you next time on Controller Chaos. Good job!